Hello. What you are hearing is VSL's new sampled piano library, the impressive Fazioli F308. And in the next few minutes, I'm going to show you why it's my favorite sampled piano in the VSL lineup. So stick around. Fazioli is an Italian piano manufacturer, and the F308 is one of the largest concert grand pianos currently in production. It really is exquisite in craftsmanship and beauty, and VSL did an amazing job capturing the warmth, power, and clarity of this piano. Now, they've assembled some pristine samples, and I can understand why Fazioli would allow their name to be put on this product. Now, before I play a little bit, let me share with you the modified preset that I'm using. I've chosen the player to surround stereo down mix in the full library, but I felt that it was a little bit dry, so I simply added the main decatry array. And I use the same settings for this mic that this mic uses in the intimate surround to stereo down mix preset. So it has the same uh, delay, the same reverb, the same stereo profile. And I feel like it just adds a little bit more of that synchron stage ambiance to the preset. And then I've come to the edit window here, and this is why I really love the uh, synchron piano software, because you can do so much with it to shape the sound. And, and I've come to the individual key edit section here, and I've simply increased the volume on the lower two octaves to give it a little bit more stronger bass sound. And of course, this doesn't change the tone of the piano at all. It simply just increases the volume when you hit the keys. And then I've added or subtracted some volume from some of the other keys as I felt it was necessary for my ears. And a lot of this has to do with the controller you're using and the speakers that you're hearing the piano played back through. And the last thing, of course, is I shape the velocity curve to accommodate my N1X. And I'll talk more about that in just a bit. But let me share with you three things that I love about this piano and, and then play and give you some examples of what I'm talking about here. First thing I love is the consistency in tone throughout all the registers. And what I mean by that is some pianos will have a very clear mid-range. Maybe they'll get uh, a little bit shrill in the upper register and a little bit muddy in the lower register and have some colorful overtones added to the sound. But the F308 has a very clean sound with strong fundamentals and it's consistent in tone from the bass all the way up through the treble. Have a listen. Did you hear the consistency in tone? In my opinion, it has uh, almost a harp-like quality. Have you ever heard a glissando played on a harp? It's very even in tone as you go up and down the registers. And harps are kind of considered to have this ethereal-like quality to the sound. And I like that the Fazioli sounds like that because I mostly arrange uh, simple hymns and spiritual songs. And I, I like that angelic-like tone throughout all the registers. Something else I really love about this piano is the wonderful detail and clarity in all the samples throughout the velocity ranges. And I'm gonna show you three examples of what I'm talking about. In this first example, it's a simple arrangement from a song titled Whispering Hope. And the first verse says, soft as a voice of an angel, breathing a lesson unheard. Hope with a gentle persuasion whispers her comforting word. And of course, I want to play this first verse softly, 
because it's talking about soft as the voice of an angel and whispering comforting words. And I can do this with the Fazioli without losing any clarity or detail in those lower velocities. Have a listen. Do you hear how clear that sounds? Uh, these samples have a very low noise floor and I think that allows the strong fundamental frequency to resonate clearly. I think strong fundamentals are inherent in Fazioli pianos and Viasal did a wonderful job capturing that. This is what's referred to as a transparent library. And it's the same thing for the mid-range. In the second verse of the same song, it says, wait till the darkness is over. Wait till the tempest is done. Hope for the sunshine tomorrow after the shower is gone. And when we're talking about waiting for the tempest to be done, I'm gonna bring in some of these lower bass notes to kind of get that rumbling effect of what it might be like as you're waiting out a tempestuous storm. And you're gonna hear how clear it is in that lower register in that kind of mid-range velocity. Have a listen. Great detail in that low and mid-range. But what's really exciting and where this piano really shines is in the upper to highest velocities. I remember when I first got this piano, I was a little bit disappointed because it, it didn't sound as um, crisp or vibrant as the demos on the VSL website. But then I realized I needed to shape my velocity curve so that I could more easily access the highest, loudest samples available because that's where the piano really shines. Notice in this last example, uh, a short excerpt from a simple arrangement and listen to the crescendo where I'm gonna reach the loudest samples available. That's the power of a Fazioli. It has this beautiful range. I mean, hear how clean that sound is. It really is a beautiful thing. So in conclusion, I really love the evenness of tone throughout all the registers, 
I love the meticulous sampling that gives this pristine detail to the sound and the fact that you could use the full range of samples from the quietest to the loudest. In my opinion, this really is the pinnacle of the Synchron Piano lineup. And I think it's a combination of the inherent qualities of a Fazioli piano combined with VSL's refined sampling process. The end result is a magnificent sampling of a premier concert grand piano that really inspires me to sit down and play. And for that, I'm grateful. I appreciate you joining me for this short review and I've covered just a few highlights of some of the things that I like about it. And hopefully you found something helpful in this review if you're considering the F308. And remember, VSL has a two-week return policy, so you can try this library out for yourself and see if you like it as much as I do. Thank you for watching, and God bless.